that's terrific. Where do you get your ideas? You have to understand something about art. It comes from someplace. What a nice view. It, it's like, it's like looking down on the stars. Would you like to hear one of my poems? Sure. Long ago, the delicate tangles of his hair covered the emptiness of my hands. Would you like to hear it again? Okay. Long ago, the delicate tangles of his hair covered the emptiness of my hands. What's the matter? Did you ever think about killing yourself? What? Why would you do that? Why shouldn't I? Because some things take care of themselves. They're not your job. Maybe they're not even your business. I, I, I like your poem. I'm a grown woman, and I live on my father's money. That restaurant that had my painting up, that's my father's restaurant. Listen, listen to me. If, if you have a choice between killing yourself and... And doing something you're scared of doing, why not take the leap and do the thing you're scared of doing? You mean stop taking money and leave L.A.? You see, you know what you're scared of doing. Why don't you do it? See what happens. Uh, you must be tired. I don't mind talking. Well, I do. This is one of those typical conversations where we're all open and sharing our innermost thoughts, and it's all bullshit and a lie, and it doesn't cost you anything. Look, I don't know you. I don't think I know anybody. You're angry? I can, I can see that. I'm very troubled. I'm not ready to... There's only so much time. We want to use it well. So I'm here, talking to you. I don't want to throw that away. I have no response to that. Maybe you should take me back to the hotel. 